Oh, good morning guys, welcome back to the channel. I'm Jason, you're watching Old Car Auto Guy. And this is supposed to be a snow day. So the reason why I'm driving the Chrysler 200 and Junior is driving bubbles is because Grampy is doing some touch up on his car. You see, when we took this car on trade, the bumper here had been bumped at one point in time and cracked all the paint. So the paint was peeling off and, you know, looking kind of terrible. So we're a little bit slow here between Christmas and New Year's. So Grampy decided he would take all this on. And a little spot back here where one of Junior's friends, Robert, bumped into him in a parking lot. So we're going to get that fixed up and Grampy is going to get, hopefully, all of this blended and painted today. Also, we have a customer's vehicle that was towed in yesterday uh, due to a no start. And uh, we have determined that this vehicle is no start because of the fuel pump. So now what we've got to determine is if the fuel pump is accessible through the back seat, which in most vehicles you can pop the back seat up and there's an access hole to the fuel pump system here. If that's the case, we should be able to get the fuel pump in and out very quickly. Otherwise, if the tank's got to come down, it tends to be a little bit more labor-intensive job. So you guys all remember this video. Well, because of that video, that led to us being able to fix an issue with this Hyundai Tucson. And for those of you who don't know, Hyundai and Kia are related, just like GM, or Chevrolet and Pontiac, or Buick and they share a lot of the same components. So when we took the fuse panel and turned it upside down because of a no start issue, we found a bad uh, corroded relay plug-in uh, that's supposed to be right here. And so we just uh, extended the wires and uh, kind of remotely located this over here. One of the relays uh, has an intermittent issue as well. So we're gonna go to the parts store and pick up another one of those. We don't know if the corrosion got inside the relay is a problem, so we're going to replace it and we'll go from there, hopefully get this customer with their Hyundai Tucson back on the road. And remember at the beginning of this video when I said this is supposed to be a storm day? Well, it did not disappoint. Well, just going for a drive in the hot rod in a snowstorm. So guys, I'm going to try and do this little update on Junior's car very quickly as the wind is starting to pick up. By the way, Happy New Year. So although it's a little bit dirty, you can see that uh, Junior's bumper, which was all cracked and spiderwebbed here, has been repaired. And as you can see right here, where the paint was all cracked and peeling, there's a little bit of a dent there where uh, Junior's friend Robbie, that's right Robbie, I'm calling you out again. No, I'm just kidding. Anyways. Uh, where Robbie had kind of bumped into it and uh, there's only slightly a little bit of a color variation when you're doing such a small section like this it's hard to know where to stop and start when it comes to blending in this particular case you know do you go halfway through the door and stop blending or do you stop at the seam well you have to stop at the seam and there is a slight variation there but it's not too bad when you're working on cheaper cars like this sometimes you do what you can and work with what you got rather than spending the thousands of dollars at a body shop.
So guys, we are officially entered into 2019. I hope that we can make 2019 a much more of a success on this channel as it has been in 2018, although I am not disappointed with the with how far that we've gotten uh, as we sit right now. We're at 505 subscribers and uh, we're hoping to get up to 1,000 by the end of the month. Yes, I know it's a little bit of a stretch, but we do have a contest on if you are new to this channel and you're not subscribed, I would consider doing so because if we get to 1,000 subscribers by January 31st, I'm giving away $1,000 cash. Trick is, you gotta be a subscriber to take advantage. So if you haven't done so already, click that subscribe button right down here. It's a red box, it says subscribe, and when you do that, a little bell notification will pop up beside it. Click that as well. That way you'll get notified each time I upload a new video. T-shirts are available in the first link in the description box below at bonfire.com and you can get your very own old car auto guy t-shirt and or hoodie multiple colors many sizes shipped right to your door guys stay focused on the windshield not the rear view mirror i love you god bless we'll see you again in the next upload <laughs>